and I have like two other tough experience can I go it now I'm from the testing background I'm from the ETL background I, I'm from the SaaS I'm from the mainframes or uh, I'm from you know Java background or I'm a full stack developer so can I move into the data engineering tool of uh, no also people have so many doubts of first time that it requires to learn data engineering related subject and how much time to crack an offer uh, uh you know so how 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 many years have experience that we can keep it you know in the uh, data engineering to get a job and to get a calls hello hi guys you come to the channel i hope everyone are doing great i'm also doing great i i see that in uh, my mailbox and uh, i'm seeing some of the folks are asking the questions i'm about uh, can i uh, move into the data engineering profile i have like 12 years of experience can i move it now uh, i'm from the testing background i'm from the etl background or i'm from the saas i'm from the mainframes or uh, i'm from you know java background or i'm a full stack developer so can i move into the data engineering uh, role of uh, you know also people have so many doubts uh, uh, how much time that it requires to learn uh, data engineering related subject and how much time to crack an offer uh, uh you know uh, so how 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 many years of experience that we can keep it you know in the uh, data engineering to get a job and to get a calls so people are having uh, most of the questions related to data engineering the role and the career i i thought to address all the questions uh, in this video so that's the reason i'm uh, i'm making this video so we we'll take the first question like we will say uh, that so many people have you know, higher experiences like 10 players or even 8 years 9 years 10 years 11 12 years or even 13 years people are also asking me the same question that can i able to move to the data engineering now uh, i can say yes you can move it to the uh, data engineering uh, but you have to start soon and you have to you have to put your uh, baby steps into the data engineering and you have to learn and you have to code uh, and you have to learn the subject like if you, you can start giving an interviews on the data engineering but yeah there is no doubt uh, next people uh, might ask some questions like you know how long it will take to learn the entire data engineering i say uh, this will uh, completely depend on person to person and uh, person to person if we have some good uh, you know experience like 10 plus or something or even 8 or uh, uh, 8 to 10 years of experience guys i can say maybe you can able to learn it in 3 4 months uh, not that much you can go to the 3 to 4 months like I, I know you already have gone through the coding phases and all if you have a coding background like java python or uh, any other coding background you will be able to learn it in like 3 months 3 months uh, but if you are new to the uh, you know uh, industry like data engineering and you are from non coding background then obviously it will take at least like 6 months minimum uh, 6 months that it will take but again it will differ, uh, differ from person to person okay so how we need to learn and what we need to learn so so many has the same doubt. just a small reminder guys i really keep so much time and energy to bring this quality content to you i'm expecting only one thing from that is your life please give a like and share your opinion on the comment section if you still have any doubts or anything related to this video please add it in the comment section below i can try to help you as soon as possible so three things we should be good at data engineering skill one thing is a sql so in the sql you should be expert so try as much as uh, possible uh, practice the questions as much as possible so you should be too good in SQL that is a basic uh, skill for the data engineering the second thing is a uh, programming like python programming not only python you can choose anyone like java scala python so in the python is easy so that most of the people will choose the python only but uh, but do i need to be expert in the programming no you should not expertise is not required at least you learn the basic things like basic how the uh, no how the if condition loops and uh, the basic structures data structures something like a list tuple uh, you know dictionary so how we can iterate out the element how can we access the elements so the basic thing how we can sort how we can get a size of it how we can uh, do the modifications okay so those things we uh, you need to be uh, practice and code on it tss are not required but you should be good in the programming and can write a codes and the you know strings or even list some alphabeticals or you know sorting or they can give some you know some small programs if you can able to crack that one in p code so that is on the python the third thing is you should be good in the spark 
So Spark is a distributed processing framework. So it should be good in the Spark because without Spark, you won't get the calls even. So if you see any of the data engineering tools, Spark is a common skill. So if you are good at SQL and Python, then you'll be good at PySpark as well. So in the PySpark, most of the coding functions, everything are uh, in the combination of Python and SQL. So if you know the SQL, mostly like a, a 60 to 70 percent of the data as a result will be filled up. So once you are practiced and you, you should be good in even on the coding too. So once you learn the coding, you try to understand internals of the Spark, how it works and when to use, uh, what are the features, drawbacks and how we need to write for a uh, code for certain functionality and all those things we can write it and slowly you can start learning on it. So once you learn uh, these things, you have to learn other things, something on the big data on the uh, how to uh, ecosystem related topics, something like uh, data lake, data warehouses, and the star schema, uh, delta lake, okay, uh, snowflake schema, uh, dimension table, fact tables, data pipelines, okay, so normalization, acid properties. So we have some uh, topics of that. So we can, uh, uh, so you should learn these topics. So if you can go to the data engineering related courses, you can find these topics. Uh, very easily so once you are uh, learn on those things you try to execute one project so to do in a project it will take minimum uh, like i can say maybe minimum two weeks and max that depends on you like maybe in the one month also we can uh, complete and the next add-on skill is cloud you can you can choose any of the cloud like aws or azure and you can pick the respective services something like storage services uh equal processing services and spark services okay or maybe data picks in the cloud if you learn the databricks it will be uh, good so if you learn all these topics uh, depends on your are uh, uh, no you are learning capability it might take somewhere between three to six uh, six months and do you practice on all those things and then you can start giving them interviews so i can recommend for a new uh, entry guys first like first you can uh, start with the sql python and uh, spark at the basic level and uh, understand the concepts with that uh, understand the concepts in the spark and other things so mostly in the technical uh, interview, most of the people will ask the questions around the databases and the sparks only. And even the manager of the interview, they can ask, expect you to answer some of the project related uh, stuff. So I think most of the service based companies will uh, roll out the offer with the three rounds itself. So you can able to crack uh, with the three rounds and you can able to jump into any other uh, uh, company. So from there on, you should start the trading again for a product based companies if you really interested. I hope this content is useful. Please give a like, add a comment, and if you have any doubts or anything, please add it in the comment section below. Thank you.